dear graduates make today your day and celebrate endings for the precede new beginnings today we stand on the threshold of a remarkable moment filled with pride accomplishment and endless possibilities on this note let's commence the graduation ceremony i request the dignitaries on the dais to present the graduates with their certificates honoring the topper of the batch i'm delighted to call upon dr rahna razak onto the dais to receive her award as the best outgoing student of the academic year 2223 i request the dignitaries on the dais to present the award Shankar S Dr Jashwan R Dr Danila NJ Dr Kaushika G Dr Kavya Rashini L डॉक्टर कौशल्या एन डॉक्टर 
Dr. Amanda S. Dr. Amna Abdul Afer. Dr. Amrita Edi. Dr. Anamika A. Dr. Ananda Lakshmi R. Dr. Anna Wilson. Dr. Anita Raj Dr. Anjali Krishna TJ Dr. Anu Ajit Dr. Anupama H Dr. Aparna A Dr. Ashwin Jose PJ Dr. Aslam Ashraf M Dr. Ashwati Prabhaval Kumar Dr. Ashwin Nagaraj Dr. Ashwini Dr. Aisha Bhubha Dr. Balamani N Dr. Bula J.S. Dr. Grisha Dr. Devu B Dr. Danshita C Dr. Danya K Dr. Fatima Dilna P. Dr. Fatima Fida. Dr. Fatima Hasma A.M. Dr. Fatima Nasla. Dr. Faumia Samar Dr. Gayatri Ji Dr. Hana Asha Sebastian Dr. Harishma P. Suti Dr. Harishma MS Dr. Helvin Rijo M Dr. Haitwa Dr. Jasla Dr. Janet Johnson B. Dr. Janai M. Dr. Khatija NS. Dr. Kiran MS. Dr. Krishna B. 
Dr. Vindra, Vrinda Parashivetan. Dr. Banamati S. Dr. Santosh Chakravarti Ji. Dr. Nandini Sokaya. Professor and Head, Department of Pharmacology, to lead the graduates in taking the Hippocratic Oath. Graduates, please kindly stand up in your respective places. Graduate of RVSDCH, I solemnly pledge that I shall abide by the principles laid down in the code of dental ethics of Indian Dental Council. I consecrate my life to the service of humanity. I will give my teachers the respect and gratitude which is their due. I will practice my profession with conscience, dignity and fear of God. The health of my patient will be my first consideration. I will respect the secrets which are confided in me by the patients. I will maintain all by means in my power, the honor and the noble traditions of the medical profession. I will treat my colleagues with respect equality and impartiality. I will not permit considerations of religion, nationality, race, politics and social standing to intervene between my duty and my patience. I will maintain the utmost respect for human life from the time of conception even under threat. I will not use my medical knowledge contrary to the laws of humanity. I make these promises solemnly, freely and upon my honor. Thank you. The pursuit of excellence is not just a goal but a continuous journey. One significant milestone in this journey is the B++ accreditation by the National Assessment and Accreditation Council. It is a testament to an institution's commitment to quality, education, innovation and continuous improvement. As we celebrate the NAC achievers, we recognize their dedication to excellence. First and foremost, I request Dr. Vijay VK, Principal and Head of Institution, to receive the Outstanding Achievement Award for his achievements in the past one year and dedicated efforts throughout the NAC journey. I kindly request our Chief Guest, Dr. Dibyendu Masundar Sir, to please present the award to our Principal.
Embassy dignitaries, college days, it is a journey of growth, learning and discovery that shapes us into the individuals we are today. Our graduates at RVS Dental College are currently pursuing post-graduation at different institutions, adding laurels to their alma mater. Now, I call upon Dr. Seronia, who is currently pursuing post-graduation in Department of Orthodontics at CSI Medical College, Madurai, representing the graduating batch of year 2023 to share a few words. Good evening to the respected dignitaries on the dais, our respected staffs, parents, conducting team, and finally, the graduates who are the superstars of today's program, their droids and their Avengers. It's my honor to stand before you representing my batch, the adroids. Beginning our journey from zero, sharing our h &E pencils, peeping cluelessly into the microscopes, dozing off during afternoon lectures, celebrating blood holy for bleeding time and clotting time, breaking test tubes, surprise tests, tooth carvings, casts being thrown, dentures being broken, porosities, protecting our prostor instruments from our friends, and sun was way cooler than prostor lab, micromotor drilling sounds, aerotor water splashing sounds, puzzled with drugs classification, ESI bus rides, straightening the curved wires to curve the straightened wire, crying along with pedo kids while finding if the tooth is primary or not. Bossing around after extracting a grade 3 mobile tooth, arguing with complete denture wearing youngsters, spraining necks while hand scaling for a CA triple plus patient, sacrificing x ray films inside the developer and fixer solution tubs, searching for x ray holder in the dark room, practicing RCT in the deep carriage management patients playing hide and seek with the canals, and none of us would ever forget the word, repeat. <laughs> Sleepless nights during examinations, record works, completing the quotas, external examiner, examination, theory paper, practical, viva exceptions, etc, etc, and etc. But still, whatever difficulties we have faced and crossed, but at the end of the day, after removing a big chunk of calculus, after taking a proper IOPR, after a restoration, after extracting a tooth, after CD or RPD insertion, or after a debonding, that sense of satisfaction we get after curing that pain or while seeing a patient smile, that moment we all would have realized it was all worth the while. Somewhere between trembling hands with a lancet to injecting local anesthesia with ease, we all became dental surgeons. This wouldn't have been possible without our staffs, as there would be no sculptures without a sculptor. A huge gratitude for those sculptors for guiding us throughout this journey. This day, is a milestone in every one of our lives. There were days of hopelessly walking through these corridors to now proudly walking in the same corridors with a title, Doctor in front of all our names. I would like to thank our college management for making such a day possible. This day is even more meaningful because we all have made our parents proud. We all may miss the non-stop talks, the long walks, late night group studies, classroom laughter, funs with the lab attenders, Adrofest and Rovanzia. But we take with us a never-ending bond. We came here as strangers, met as friends, and living as a family. I would like to conclude by saying, we did it, guys. A very, very 
all the best for everyone's future journey thank you thank you dr seronia with a passion for learning and a relentless pursuit of excellence dr rahna has been a consistent top performer in all the clinical years in academic and the clinical settings i invite dr rahna razak representing the graduating batch of 2024 to share a few words good evening distinguished guest faculty parents and fellow graduates as we stand on the brink of this momentous occasion i am extremely honored and humbled to address the gathering on behalf of my batch today marks the end of years of hard work and dedication and unwavering support of those who have guided us along the journey our college wasn't just about academics it was about the connections we made and the friendship we built whether it was frowning at cadaver in our anatomy class to him having a special place in our heart or bonding with a classmate during late night study session we grew in a way we hope to i'll be forever indebted to the friendships i have made in this college and i take this moment to appreciate our esteemed principal sir teachers and my dear mentors thank you for your tireless effort in imparting us with knowledge nurturing our growth and instilling in us a passion for our profession thank you so much but as we stand here now adorned in our caps and gowns we must never forget the unsung heroes of our life our parents to my mom and dad thank you for sacrificing endlessly and believing in me even when i doubted myself i thank you from the bottom of my heart in closing though this may be the end of a chapter it also heralds the beginning of wondrous possibilities congratulations vanzers and adroids our journey in aries dental college might have ended but our impact on the world has just begun thank you gratitude is not only the greatest virtue but the parent of all others now i would like to invite dr vigneshwaran sir professor and head department of oral surgery to deliver the vote of thanks in words but in the heart which expresses it i deem it's a great honor and privilege to propose the vote of thanks on this memorable occasion let me first of all start giving glory to the almighty god for making today's occasion a resounding success first and foremost i would like to thank our chairman kalli tandai thiru kv kuppusamy ayya avargal who has been really instrumental in shaping our institution and because of his constant endeavors we have emerged as a leading dental institution i would like to extend my sincere thanks to our honorable chief guest dr divendu mujumdar sir president dental council of india thank you sir for gracing the occasion in spite of your busy schedule today we had the opportunity to learn more lot of experiences and it is really thought provoking sir i also extend my gratitude to the guest of honor dr gavi ravindran sir whose guidance and moral support has helped us a lot and our chief advisor dr badri sir who has been a constant source of inspiration and support my heartfelt thanks to our principal dr vijay vk for his commitment towards excellence i would like this i would take this opportunity to thank the other college principals like siddha homeopathy nursing pharmacy and engineering needless to mention our pillars of rvs trustee mr balachandran sir thank you sir i would also like to thank all the head of the departments my colleagues faculty members of all clinical and basic science departments and interns all this wouldn't have been possible without your efforts i also want to thank our administrative officer mr rajagopalan sir who has always been supportive of all our initiatives i also want to thank the photography team sulu media for their interest in covering the event and the food team who made this event more memorable I also extend my sincere thanks to ministerial staff, supporting staff and the technical team who have worked day and night to make this event a successful one. 
last but not the least this event i would like to thank the graduation organizing team without whose efforts this event wouldn't have been a grand success before uh, ending with a quote i like to for the graduates how you have made parents proud kindly make your teachers and our institution proud keep trying and all the best do well and your future is in your hands you will shine you have that confidence you will shine finally i would like to end with an inspiring quote of martin luther king or an individual has not started living until he can rise above the narrow confines of his individualistic concerns to the broader concerns of all humanity thank you